Hey, my legion, how y'all doing today? I'm back with another review, and this is something I never heard of uh, from Vel Velveeta's cheesy box dinner sets uh, that they had. And the first time, I didn't even know they made these, and then the uh, first time I saw it was two years ago. Uh, Trav did uh, one of the skillet ones on his channel where he did uh, cheesy skillets tuna melt. They look really good, and I, I still didn't buy any. Uh... I still didn't buy any at the time, and then I just, I was looking around, so I usually get the banquet ones, and I saw this, and this is in the skillet meal, it's a casserole, it'll be the cheesy casserole shepherd's pie, and this looked really good, can't remember how much this was at Walmart, now it's a little more complex than the very simple uh, banquet homestyle bakes, uh, says what you need, right there, you need a pound of ground beef, one and a quarter cups of water, one and a quarter cups of uh, milk. I can't remember what milk I got. They said half, 2%, but I think I might have gotten different. And it says uh, two tablespoons of butter. And it said unsalted butter, but I just put margarine in there. Heat oven to 425 degrees. And then on here, with the meat, the meat filling, <clears throat> you have to ground, uh, ground, brown, <laughs> Brown ground beef in a large skillet drain and return the meat to the skillet, right? Then you add the water, vegetables, and seasoning because it comes with a vegetable and seasoning pouch. They're very, both separate. And uh, stir. Bring to a boil. Cook for one minute. Then you reduce heat. Simmer for five minutes, stirring frequently, right? And then in the meantime, there's a thing of potatoes in there. And you, uh, in a microwave-safe bowl, you mix... Mashed potatoes, milk, and butter in a microwave bowl and, you know, stir it all up as much as you can because the butter won't melt. And then you microwave on high for three minutes and then you stir it some more. Let it stand. Then you uh, spoon the beef filling in a two-quart casserole dish right here. You spread the cheese sauce over the filling. It comes with, with a cheese sauce. I'll tell you what, it comes with two packets, one packet of seasoning, one packet of uh, vegetables, dried vegetables. It comes with a big pack of mashed potato, instant mashed potatoes. And it comes with that um, that cheese and the aluminum thing that you get with the Velveeta macaroni and cheese. A thing of that, right? And like I said, you uh, spoon the beef into a two-quart casserole. Spread the cheese sauce over the filling. cover, And then you cover with the potato topping and you top with the potatoes. That you made and you bake it oven at 425 degrees for 18 to 20 minutes. Or until filling is heated through and topping is going brown. And it says caution, casserole is uh, contents of heart, hot. And it says if you want to, you can add like a half cup of frozen corn. But that that thing was full. And the casserole dish I had was full. So let's give it a shot what the final dish looked like. Now, I took a thumbnail of what the casserole dish looked like when I took it out of the oven. It'd probably be a good idea to let it sit maybe five minutes to let it cool down a little bit. Give this a shot. Not too bad, pretty decent. The potatoes kind of like have like a, with that seasoning and stuff, is that just the meat itself has like a beef stroganoff taste to it with the sauce. And that's definitely cheesy with that Valveda sauce already in the packet. And the potatoes are pretty much just taste like instant potatoes, even though uh, it's not bad. I don't mind this at all. Pretty decent. I give this probably about 7.5 out of 10. Well, there you have for hmm. Alvita's Cheesy Casserole Shepherd Pie Dinner Mix. A decent meal for you and your family. Not too bad. About on the same spectacular level as uh, Banquet Bakes, but probably a little bit better than them. I mean... I mean, the potatoes are just like instant potatoes on top of 
on top of like a if you let's say like the meat from a uh oh, beef stroganoff right and you got some dehydrated vegetables with cheese and then instant mashed potatoes it's what it tastes like it's not bad pretty decent but nothing to really blow you away but it's really delicious i said a uh, seven and a half out of ten for uh Velveeta's Cheesy Casseroles Dinner uh, Kit, Shepherd's Pie. So until next time, bye. Shout out to Trav for letting me know. Being the first one let me know about Velveeta's uh, Cheesy Skillets, but there's a Cheesy Casserole. Took me two years to do one, but thank you anyways, Trav. You're a good, great guy, and I, I really enjoy your video. I watched your video again just for nostalgia's sake, too, and you did like your old-fashioned uh, thing that goes, like I did on my parody video. So... Hope y'all enjoyed this uh, video for my Monday Night Raw, or should I say my Monday Night Maggie meal. Uh, Velveeta's Cheesy Casserole, Shepherd's Pie Dinner Kit, or I should say Velveeta's uh, Shepherd's Pie Cheesy Casserole Dinner Kit. That's why I'll probably say on the thumbnail, on the uh, description of the video, or on the title of the video, dang it. So until next time, bye, please take care of my allegiance.